All right, we were walking. Uh, we we're walking to this new spot that the guy from the lighthouse tells about. I mean, he wasn't from. He didn't work in the lighthouse, but. I think it's better but the way, from the lighthouse. The way you, yeah, the way that you like just describe it. Oh, the man from the lighthouse, he told us to come here. Has a very strange name, but the pictures looked great. And we're thinking about going to the movies, which I am surprised because I'm, I'm down, actually. We're doing a relaxing Sunday today, I think. I was just saying how like it's hard to talk sometimes when like it's oh, yeah, called like cold pronunciating. Trying to go in? Yeah. They, uh, look what's this lady doing over here. What the hell? Look good. Look good? Yeah. Dude, you get Go ahead, that's, that's salmon. Smoked salmon. Yeah. Okay, check this out. This is my favorite part of the meal. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think, Donald? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. You good? Yeah. Real good. Good. Yeah, yeah, this is pretty good ass French toast. I mean, it's not the healthiest, but uh, but dang, it's like top three. I would say I was really hungry, but I'd say top three French toast. You excited for Invisible Man, Jake? Yep. Yeah. I'm ready to get invisible. Ricky, how excited are you for this? I'm really excited for this. I've been looking forward to this for like two years. We walking. We walking. These subways are confusing, but I guess we've been riding like a bunch of ones that we can't get used to. That's the problem. <laughs> See. Wait, oh shit, I was filming that. <laughs> hey, don't put this part in. We are off to see the Invisible Man, AKA Jake, when a girl asks, what are we? Damn. <laughs> How you feel about that, Jake? How do you feel I about don't that, feel Jake? nothing. <laughs> oh man. It's the wind, man, it's the wind. If there wasn't this much wind, you'd be fine. Bet you if you live in like inner Massachusetts, it's not that bad, wow. What the hell's going on here? It's, word. it's fine, you're fine. Yeah. I mean, the sexual uh, predator, <laughs> offender, like, yeah. you know? It won't make a difference to his employer. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I'll go ahead and hire sexual offenders. We all good up here in the company. Um. I feel like seven days, now by the seventh day, I'm like, damn, seven days was a bit much. However, I think we really grasped the city, you know? I think we really got to do a lot of things. I wish we did a little bit more at Salem. I do like the days where we just kind of winged it. The Harvard day was pretty fun. We didn't have yeah. a plan. We just kind of like went out, tried to, tried to find an adventure. The Fenway day was really fun. This is a pretty interesting theater. Wow, that's amazing. We can be movie theater bar flies. That, that's usually me at home. It almost looks like Drew, except. Yeah, what the hell? Yeah, that almost. That's kind of weird. What the Ooh. is going it's on here? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Someone more buffer. We'd be hiring sexual predators at the Drew and L company. Yeah, you won't get hired unless that's what you've got. Yeah, exactly. Sometimes that's the best type of people to get. So we got a we got a little vending vending machine for tattoos. These looks pretty cool. I, I kind of want this one right here because you know I like Halo. But um. Yeah, Jake's in there. But the thing is, you can't really choose it, so it's gonna be coming out like pretty random. Uh, choose it? They're no, like, they're random. It's just oh, random tattoos, course. bro. Come, come so who are you gonna get? Who I want? Who do you want? Frank gets this one right yeah, here. Yeah, I'm hoping yeah. that. So we can put it on his cheek. You can put that on my face. It reminds me of home. All right, let's see who Drew gets. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. You oh, can either get a tattoo cardboard. or a sticker. I can't open, open it. Open it the other way, but with this way. Oh, it's a tattoo. Oh, jeez, wow. Oh, hell yeah, we good. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah. oh that's nice. Damn, I did nice. good. You did good. You this did good. This looks like a Frank tattoo. He would get this that, like legit. That'd be, he would legit get this neck, on his like body. Like right here. This ain't even a joke. Yeah, go for it. Go for it, okay. Jake. Let's hope. Let's hope. Let's hope. Let's hope. Let's hope. hope for the best, get that but right expect now. the worst. <laughs> dude, you could just hit me, dude. Oh, no. All right, so Jake doesn't get a tattoo. We'll get an extra 50 cents, so it's fine. All right. All right. I guess uh, Ricky's gonna go. What do we get? Who do we get? Must be Drew. They must love you guys. Go whatever we want, whichever one we want. All right, what do we Donald get? What do Donald get? Oh, that's Donald's style right there. I like that one. Okay, we're gonna try this one, guys. We're gonna try to get this bad boy. It'll probably work for you. It's out. It's gone. Because they stole a whole dollar. They stole our dollars. There's nothing in there. I guess me and uh, Jake don't get tattoos, so. I mean, shit. You just. I guess so. We just got out of the movie theater. We want to watch this movie called The Invisible Man. What do you think about the movie, Drew? I bet. Sorry. Um, uh, uh, entertaining. <laughs> yes, entertaining. That is one word That's, you can describe yes. it. <laughs> Let's go to the movie expert, Ricky. Um, the movie. How'd you, how'd you pretty do? good movie. Uh, fun horror film. 
Horror, you say it's horror? Well, I mean, it's based on the universal monster, the invisible man, so. Jake. Yes. What do you think of the movie, Jake? I thought it was an interesting concept, but it was kind of just like made ordinary by the typical cliches. An Invisible Man is cool to think about. I think they could have done a lot more. Ricky should make the next Invisible Man movie. I think so too. Donald! He's, he's like, what do you think? Enjoyable. Enjoyable. That's one word, that's it. That's it. I will agree with Drew and Donald. Pretty much all we did today was uh, get some food and watch a movie. The internet too much. We ain't doing nothing else. Can go home, play some games, and that's about it. I know. Nothing. Beautiful today, because tomorrow we have to go back to California. But yeah, we just up in the city, the city of Boston, late at night. Kind of disappointed it never snowed, man. I wanted to snow so yeah. bad. Yeah, he got, he got world star. Yeah, pretty he got like, world star! <laughs> it's like, I got the Don, dude! <laughs> I'm really gonna miss the public transit. The public transit is so cool here. Now we in a bus. It's crazy. Don't you like buses? All right. Yeah, yeah, there are. Nice bus, though. Yeah, this is. This is like bus is dirty and nasty. Yeah, I know. I like how they they like they knew they messed us up with shutting down the I green line. That's they took this, yeah. yeah, but they were like, we're gonna get him some extra nice stuff today. Go get him the good shit today. Mm -hmm. Italian restaurant with four um, four of the what's that dollar signs? So this is like the fanciest place we've been all week. I'm about to get swordfish, maybe, maybe. Probably no, not. Actually. I don't think he is. That's too. He doesn't like seafood. Donald, what you getting, Donald? Pork chop. Pork chop. Ooh. Okay. Grilled salmon. That's good too. Chicken strips. Chicken. And I don't know what I'm getting yet. I don't even think they have chicken strips, chicken you liar. Hey, yeah, try it, try it, try it. This is not like any other wine you've had before. Nope, Drew made me. Try it. What? Nope. Try it. No, no, nope. try it. Put in your Ooh. mouth. <laughs> nope. Open your <laughs> lips. Okay, sir. <laughs> that's my shit. That's your shit. I don't know what he's doing, but that's his. Same thing, same thing. That's, that's uh, the rich. What's that green sauce? Whoa, that's tight. Damn, I don't know who looks beautiful or which one looks more beautiful. So we had to go, uh, Take an Uber to this place because apparently everything closes early in Massachusetts. Hey, so it ain't no uh, thanks Frank for buying that shit by the way. Oh yeah, I you're welcome. Anytime, I'm just gonna say yeah. that on here. So now $10. That's, that's for all the stuff that... I'm about to get a raise when I get about, back, that's for sure. We're talking about Ricky marrying some girl way too fast. Like and after I'm afraid, three months of dating. And I'm afraid. I've never had... Oh don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it, don't do it. Like Frodo, don't do it. Don't let him do it, he's gonna die. He'll die, don't let him do it. I guess so that's the house. That's where we uh, stayed the last seven days. I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys around. If you look closely right here, it's too obvious, but I don't know if this was us or if it was already there before we got there. So, unfortunately, we're never gonna know. It's okay though, because Drew was the one who did the Airbnb, so it don't matter. Go to the right, this is where the living room is, where Donald is uh, watching Hulu. Cause you know, you can't only do that in Boston, so he wants to do that here. This is where we ate all our food. Um, this, this, if you wanna know, that is, Ricky's chair, that was mine, that was Drew's, the one where ja Donald's jacket's on is Donald's, and that was Jake's. And we never moved for the last seven days, those were our chairs. If you try to go in someone else's chair, it's just hands. Exactly, that's what happened, so. It's easily the worst part of the whole house when we screwed it up, but now that's shit nice. I cooked a meal here once, so you'll see that in the video. We have this tiny little dining room, tiny little, to a little square, there's Jake. We're getting ready to get the f out. We're gonna go to his uh, room after this. First we'll go upstairs. And then of course the big first room you see is the math and bath bedroom. Whoa! Whoa, 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 Drew, oh, Drew! Oh, uh, you God, you know I had time. people coming, what are you doing? Yeah. Oh my I'll god. Yeah, that's oh what I was my god. Oh my god. Nice damn. buddy, nice, nice. Anyways, this is, <laughs> this is Drew's room. It's the best room in the house, that's why I took it first. I was like, I get the best room. I actually thought it'd be attached to a bathroom, but no, I didn't get that lucky. Drew's over here uh, downloading the footage. the footage, looking at yeah. all the footage. So There's some funny stuff in there. There's gonna be some funny stuff in there. We'll see, we'll see. Let's mm -hmm. go to the next bedroom. Go down this hall. You got our bathroom that we all shared. And there's the bathroom that I uh, took my famous bath picture. We got a scale to see how fat we can get this weekend. And uh, we all gained about 10 pounds. It's in Donald's room. With his uh, super Mexican blanket just chilling right there. We'll go to my room. That's where I slept. And this is where I did my homework, because Drew would make me edit every single day that I was here, so that was not fun. And then I can't show you today, but I did go up in this attic up here, which I will show you with the GoPro, because I have footage of that up there. This is the basement, where the youngins slept. I don't know if that stains the but it's cool, whatever. And there goes look who it is, the other editor. Hi, it's me. Jake! I was just yeah. I'm just kidding, Ricky. <laughs> and he's just standing here, I don't know what he's doing. Let's put it on a chapstick. Okay, so he had to need the light, I guess. Just finishing packing some things up, saying goodbye. 
Um, trying to fit everything into my suitcase. I bought a little bit more souvenirs than I think I had room for. Nice, buddy. Yeah, they're just awkward souvenirs that can like easily get crushed, so there's that. Oh. Getting our shit washed in here, we're almost done. This is our laundry mat that we had. Treadmill that we never use, because we just walk everywhere anyway. And this is where the boys slept. All right, so the bed on the right was uh, Jake's, and the bed on the left was uh, Ricky's. And this is their restroom. Jake took a shower every day. So if you want some of his uh, pubes, I have them on eBay. Yeah, but hold on, I need a sweet dose. Don't show that. <laughs> <laughs> we, had to, we had to fight for the hot water, though. We so. did. Literally, <laughs> only like two people can take a shower, and then and they would run out of hot water. Donald, how was your trip? Enjoyable. Is that all you have? That's it. Okay, a man, a few words. I like it. <laughs> Jake, how was your trip, Jake? It was very good. We drank every day. It was like living like a week of being like a heavy alcoholic, but I still feel I, I feel alive. Do I feel like I probably lost one and a half to like three and a half IQ points? So nice. we'll we'll see when I get back, and I have to readjust to the Californian climate. Yes, yes. <laughs> Ricky, how was the trip? Oh, it was good. Very historical. Gave you a lot of perspective. Made me realize how much of a bitch I was because of the uh, the weather, the the people with their grit and their work ethic and their sense of community. Very good trip. Got everything out of it that I wanted and more and uh, a lot of pounds. <laughs> Drew! What's up? How's your trip, Drew? Uh, the trip was um, pretty forgettable because I don't remember really anything that we did, clearly. <laughs> um, <laughs> That's all of us, buddy, like, good job. I was trying to like p figure out how to sort all the footage and I'm like, Day one, day two, day one, day two. Without looking at the footage, I couldn't remember. I was like, what What the hell did we do day one and day two? So I think it's just one of those things. I feel like I was very happy, happy that we did this now. When usually if you're not like super homesick by day seven, then there's a, there's a problem. You didn't Something stay long enough. enough. Yeah. yeah, you didn't stay long enough. So I feel homesick, but I know when I get back home, I'm gonna be like, this is you know, one of the better experiences in my life, in oh, my personal sure. opinion, yeah, so. so. We were just talking about all the terrible things that the wind did that fucked up the house, yeah, like uh, the door, obviously, the, door. Uh, the, the drink. The cup is built over from yeah. the rain. Yeah, the cup Donald, that's, uh, yeah. Don was the only one that witnessed that the one. Um, the, uh, just the mess that was made here, the wind kind of blew body. a bunch of, yeah, yeah that's what I was gonna say, like the dead hooker, uh, just all, the wind was really just trying to f us this weekend. Apparently, Donald might have been abducted. I don't know where that came from, Dom. Yeah, you probably definitely should figure that whole thing out, cause you. you that yeah, yeah, yeah. Your doctor, your doctor said Dr. it, it Dr. should. Uh, yeah, that doctor said out. I should get that shit checked, cause I don't know how clean your uh, sleepwalking Donald is. Like, he might just take any old syringe and just be like, "That's good enough." <laughs> Bam. <laughs> Speaking of which, I don't know if we ever uh, talked about our theory about what would happen if you inject yourself <laughs> with uh, marinara sauce. Yeah. Pretty sure marinara sauce. I don't know if it would kill you. It depends on how much you that's inject into your veins, right? Is that what you guys did? Here? Man, oh, that's it! Hey, that's it. Really oh, awesome. We had to check out if the marinara sauce theory was gonna work. Looks like you're fine. So apparently, <laughs> you're good. You're running stronger than ever, huh, Donald? Yeah, I mean, it's it's marinara sauce. I mean, I have to tell you. A mixture of local blood clots and debris lodging into lung cap capillaries. Whether you'd survive or not would depend mainly on quantity of sauce and rate of injection. Hey, I was right. Woo! I told you that Woo! yesterday. Cole. <laughs> and so look, Donald, be, be thankful we didn't inject too much of that shit into you. So yeah, we good. We good. May Indiana Jones find you one day after he was sexually assaulted by George Lucas. Mm -hmm. We took a photo, we took the last photo. Let me see. It's pretty good. Yeah, that's tight. Jake that's looks tight. Giant. Yeah, I know. And we leave it. There it is. And we're gonna come back in 10 years. We're gonna come back every 10 years. 2030, 2040, 2050. We're gonna come when we 70, 80. I don't care how badly don't don't wanna come back. I'm gonna drag his ass back. It's gonna be great. Don no, still rocking his double backpack look. Don be looking like a, a Gears of War character. Does. Like running. He's Marcus Phoenix. Yeah, there it is. Oh shit. Last time, realistically, we might ever see this block in our lives. That's kind of crazy. Yeah, yeah. We might not never see this place again. Somehow, we also didn't sustain any injuries or no one got sick. We still got a journey back home, but I thought someone was gonna get an injury. Now we must enter the final boss. Avoid getting the the airports some of the biggest airports in the world boston and lax just thinking about that kind of makes my balls like go up into my body so that's cool so we had nothing to worry about with the door the door was he just I said just no worries yeah i know it's not his house he doesn't care we just found out that there was a public library kind of 
sitting right next to us. Pretty badass public library. I wouldn't mind going in and also this like epic ass building. Every place looks like Hogwarts still. It's still happening. The 90, oh shit. Well, that was bad. I almost got ran over by those cars. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. <laughs> stay right there for him, we'll stay right here for him. Gotta make Jake live life, or Ricky live life more dangerously. We'll do nothing bad, nothing bad. Dude, that's how, that's that, the most fun we've had is when we started doing bad shit. Yeah. Like for me, like oh, no, it's always sure. been like that. Especially because we live in Lakewood. Yep. Nothing bad ever happened. Though. And even to this day, like the bad things, it's just like, oh yeah, now I'm having fun. <laughs> like when we did the museum thing, we stuck in that museum. In? Yeah, 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 that was the fun, that was like a fun moment for me, even though it was only five minutes. This is the perfect time about the dead hookers. Oh, flag. Is this the embassy or something? Canadian, German. Why would those three be together? Canada, Germany, America flag. Hopefully place. Future Frank will do the research to figure out that and he'll give you a long, intricate, detailed essay about. We ain't taking no chances today, guys. No chances right here. Bam. Make sure. Oh, shit. <laughs> be good now. I ain't gonna drink no Corona beer today. All right, guys, we're going back to uh, Boston International Airport. The last tram or train or anything we're gonna ride until we get on a plane. It was good times. It was fun. It was real. It was a real fun. Oh, we didn't talk about the hooker? Yeah, we're not gonna talk about the hooker, so we're taking that off. I think this has been the last three years is the most flights I've ever done in my entire life. I've gone to Hawaii, Texas, New York, New Jersey, now Boston. All in the span of two years. So um, it's like kind of crazy. crazy, to be honest. Before I that, I was I only been in like California and Las Vegas. It's more like you learn something new every time so that you're more better prepared the next time you go on a plane. Oh, I see, yeah. At least for me. And just vacationing in general, you're probably good at that. Yeah, at this point. You know, know. what to remember and stuff. And yeah, exactly, what's yeah. bringing one on. You wanna go there? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Tacos and tortas. Tacos and tortas, yeah. mi amigos. That's like where I'm from. All right, so we are in our seats. We are actually in the nice seats. in the nice little emergency exit seats. Get extra, extra look at all this extra right space. I mean, it don't look that good in the GoPro, but it's real. Yeah, it's real the nice. We got to sit next to nobody. Donald got the little corner seat now, and then we don't got to sit next to people, even though these people are over there by themselves. Like so, hopefully we get home safely. Hopefully, nah. Okay, let's bring this shit down. <laughs> okay, tree, stupid.